We're making holes in parts today and it is so simple, you won't believe you didn't know how to do it before. To do this, first things first, we have to be in the right spot. We're gonna be in the model tab. The model tab has all of the tools that we need for this. Then I am going to grab a part that is going to be the part that I'm gonna put a hole in. So this one right here is going to just have a circular hole in the middle of it. It does not matter, it's whatever you need it to be. Then I'm going to choose a part that's going to be the shape of the hole. So this one right here, the cylinder, I want a round hole, so I chose a cylinder. I'm gonna go ahead and size it and make it so that it is in the exact position that I want the hole to be in. All right, I have my cylinder placed where I want it. You can tell it's going all the way through the part so we can see that it is penetrating all the way through the block. This is going to be my eraser. The green is the eraser. So with that eraser selected, I'm gonna click negate. That has now turned that part into an actual eraser. Now I'm going to use control or command and click the part that I want to erase the cylinder from. So now I have the negative part selected and the part that I'm going to erase from. Then I'm gonna choose union. I'm gonna glue them together. And now I have a hole right through my part. Negate, then union, and you're good to go. You can take edges off corners. You can put holes in balls. You can build all sorts of crazy things. Just remember that that negative part still technically exists in the world, but there's no collider on it or anything like that. So if you get crazy with the modeling, you're gonna have lots of parts being drawn on your screen. Hopefully that helps. Let me know what you use this for in the comments and let me know what you wanna see me do next. All right, let's get out there and build some Roblox games.